Tabby cats are some of the most popular and well-known pet cats. Tabbies are loved by cat fans all over the world because of their unique coat patterns and sweet personalities. In this video, we'll talk about the most common questions people have about tabby cats and give full answers to help us learn more about these wonderful pets. Number 1. What are the four types of tabby cats? There are four basic coat designs for tabby cats. There are mackerel, ticked, spotted, and classic, which is also called marbled. Most tabby cats have the mackerel pattern, which is what most people think of when they hear the word tabby. Number 2. Are tabby cats friendly? Tabbies like to talk to people. Because they like people and are nice. Tabbies make great pets, especially for kids. They love being with their human families and other cats or dogs in your home. Number 3. Why are cats called tabby? People say that the long, thin lines that run up and down the sides look like a fish skeleton, which is where the name of the pattern comes from. People think that this was the first pattern for tabby cats. Number 4. What type of cat is a tabby? Tabby is a type of cat. Tabby is not a breed of cat, but a type of coat design. It can have bands, whorls, spots, and other things on its body. All of these different kinds have their own names, but tabby cats often have a mark in the shape of a M just above their eyes. Number 5. Are tabby cats rare? The tabby design is found in many official cat breeds. It is also a characteristic of Landris cats, which make up most of the cats in the world. Number 6. Why are tabby cats so special? When it comes to their personalities, tabbies are thought to be friendly, happy-go-lucky, smart, sassy, very loving, and great pets. Red tabbies, which are also known as orange, ginger, and marmalade tabbies, can be bossy and strong-willed. Number 7. Is Garfield a tabby cat? Garfield, a lazy, fat, and cynical orange tabby Persian cat, is the main character of the comic strip. People know that he likes lasagna and sleeps a lot, and that he hates Mondays, his friend Nermal, and exercise. Number 8. What do tabby cats eat? Your cat can eat both canned and raw foods, as well as kibbles with a low grain level. Use cat toys with moving parts to get your cat to play. If your cat spends all day sleeping, cuddling, or staring out the window, it probably isn't burning as many calories as it eats. Number 9. Are tabby cats expensive? Here are a few tips about how much tabby cats cost. Tabby cats that are randomly bred can cost $100 or less. Purebred tabby cats can cost between $700 and $1,500. Designer cats like the Bengal can cost up to $2,000 or more. Number 10. How long do tabby cats live? People like tabby cats, but how long do tabby cats live? A tabby cat can live between 12 and 15 years on average, but some can live to be 18 or older. Number 11. What is the rarest tabby cat? Rosette pattern. The agouti gene is responsible for the rosette pattern, which is also called the spotted tabby pattern. This is a less common version of the design. Bengals, Serengetis, Egyptian mouse, Arabian mouse, Maine coons, and other breeds often have it. Number 12. Is a tabby cat a purebred? Tabby is not a breed of cat, but a pattern of fur that is common in both purebred and mixed breed cats. These cats are generally called domestic short haired or long haired cats. The standard tabby has a pattern of dark spots or swirls on a lighter colored coat. 
Number 13. What is the most common tabby color? Tabbies can be any color you want. The brown or brown-gray tabby, which is usually a mix of brown, black, and gray, is the most popular type. You can also get tabbies that are gray, orange, cream, or buff. Number 14. Is tabby a breed or color? People often think of tabbies as a breed, but their markings are actually a coat pattern that can show up in a surprising number of different types. Tabbies can be brown, gray, orange, or even black, and they can have stripes, spots, whorls, and bands on them. Number 15. Why do tabby cats meow so much? Cats may meow a lot if they are in pain or if they have problems with their nerves, senses, or brain, such as hearing or vision loss or problems with their brain. Cats can make a lot of noise for a number of reasons, including anxiety, anger, frustration, and other behavioral problems. Number 16. How loyal are tabby cats? Tabbies are very friendly and loving. A tabby cat is a faithful and caring friend. Number 17. Why are tabby cats always female? Because the color of a tabby is linked to its gender, an orange female must get two orange genes, one from each parent, while a red male only needs one. Since any red color is epistatic, all orange cats are tabbies, and solid red show cats are generally low contrast tick tabbies. Number 18. What country are tabby cats from? The tabby pattern is one of the most popular coat colors. It goes back to cats that were kept as pets in Egypt. It is a known color variety in breeding cats and is often seen in cats with a mix of different breeds. Number 19. What is the real name for a tabby cat? Domestic cats with stripes. Dots, lines, or flowing patterns on their fur are called tabby cats, gray tigers, or just tabbies. On their heads, these cats often have a mark that looks like the letter M. Tabbies aren't a breed of cat. Number 20. How big do tabby cats get? Tabby cats can be between 9 and 10 inches tall. Since tabbies can come from any breed of cat, their sizes can be very different. Depending on the breed, these cats can get as tall as 16 inches and weigh about 18 pounds. On average, though, a tabby cat will grow to be about 9 to 10 inches tall and weigh about 10 pounds. Number 21. Do tabby cats live the longest? Most tabby cats live from 12 to 18 years. Compared to cats that live outside, this is pretty long. People have seen cats that live on the streets live for at most 2 to 5 years. This is because there are a lot of risks for a cat when it lives outside. Number 22. Where do tabby cats like to be pet? Most cats like to be scratched between their ears, at the base of their ears, on their cheeks, and under their chins, where they have smell glands. They may also like light pressure on their neck and back, stopping just before their tail. Number 23. What is the oldest tabby cat? Cream Puff is the tabby cat who is the oldest. The cat has been alive for 38 years and 3 days. Cream Puff, a tabby mix, is the oldest cat that has ever lived, according to Guinness World Records. Jake Perry of Austin, Texas, was her owner. Number 24. How long can tabby cats go without water? Terina L. Anthony, DVM, owner and medical head of the Aurora Cat Hospital and Hotel in Aurora, Colorado, says no more than 24 hours. Number 25. What do tabby cats need to survive? Since cats eat meat, you'll need to give them a meal full of it. Tabby cats need to play and get exercise every day so they don't get into trouble. Your pet will be safe if you keep it inside and take it to the vet regularly. Number 26. 
Are tabby cats smart? Tabbies are intelligent and friendly. These unusual animals are very smart and love to cuddle. They like to be held and paid a lot of attention. Tabbies can get pretty angry, though, if they don't get what they want. Since they are usually very smart, though, they usually get what they want. Number 27. Are tabby cats lucky? In many countries, black tabby cats have been thought of as good luck charms for a long time. In ancient Egypt, they were treated like gods, and in the Middle Ages, people thought tabby cats could do magic. In many parts of the world, black tabby cats are still seen as signs of good luck. Number 28. How can you tell a true tabby cat? There is more than one design on a tabby cat's coat. This pattern has vertical, narrow, curved lines on the sides of the cat's body. The bars and spots on the cat's stomach and flanks can be continuous or broken up. There is a M shape on the cat's face, and dark lines go from the corners of its eyes to its cheeks. Number 29. What is the genetics of a tabby? Most tabby patterns in household cats, including those seen in most breeds, are caused by the tabby gene on chromosome A1. Tabbies with the dominant allele tam are called mackerel tabbies, and tabbies with the recessive allele tab are sometimes called classic tabbies or blotched tabbies. Number 30. Can tabby cats see color? Cats have two color detecting cones that let them see bands of light that are blue violet and yellow green, but not red orange. So, like dogs, cats mostly see things in shades of yellow, gray, and blue, but some studies think cats may also see some shades of green. Number 31. Why is my tabby cat so clingy? Pet Bucket says that your cat may be clingy because they are not getting enough mental and physical exercise. In these situations, it can help to take breaks to play with your cat and give them interactive things to keep them active and busy all day. Number 32. Why do tabby cats not like being held? Some cats get scared when they are picked up and held because they feel like they are being held back. This makes it harder for them to get away if something scares them. Cats are independent, and even though they like to be up high, they like to choose their own spot and not be held back while they're there. Number 33. Are tabby cats bossy? People say that tabby cats have friendly personalities. People say that they are both very smart and very loving. But they can also be bossy and sassy, just like any cat. How they were taught and how they are in general will shape who they are. Number 34. Why do tabby cats meow so much? Cats may meow a lot if they are in pain or if they have problems with their nerves, senses, or brain, such as hearing or vision loss or problems with their brain. Cats can make a lot of noise for a number of reasons, including anxiety, anger, frustration, and other behavioral problems. Number 35. Are tabby cats a healthy breed? Tabby cats' health can change based on their breed, but on average, they can live for more than 15 years. The health problems most often seen in tabby cats that are covered by ASPCA pet health insurance are hyperthyroidism, vomiting, urine problems, upset stomach, and weight loss. Number 36. Can tabby cats stay small? Tabby cats come in different sizes based on the breed. Usually, a grown cat won't weigh more than 18 pounds, no matter what breed it is. Number 37. How much should a tabby cat eat? Adult cats need 20 kilocalories per pound of body weight. So, a healthy 10-pound adult cat should eat 200 calories every day. Number 38. Do tabby cats pick a favorite person? Even if they were well socialized as babies, cats tend to like one person more than others. 
Cats are great at communicating, and they tend to be drawn to people with whom they get along well. Look for signs that your cat wants to talk to you, like when it comes up to you for food or attention. Number 39. Can tabby cats drink milk? Milk is not the best thing for cats to drink, unfortunately. In fact, it can cause a number of health problems, such as stomach upset, cramps, and very bad diarrhea. Cow's milk makes a lot of cats sick because they can't handle lactose or because it makes them lose water. Number 40. Can tabby cats eat bananas? Bananas are usually thought to be safe for cats, so the short answer is yes. Number 41. Can tabby cats see in the dark? Just like people, cats can't see in the dark when there is no light. But when there isn't much light, like on a clear night, they can see better than we can. Number 42. Do tabby cats get jealous? Cats can get angry, yes. Cats, dogs, and other animals can make cats very envious. They can also get jealous if their owners pay more attention to everyday chores or a house guest than to them. Number 43. Can tabby cats eat rice? Yes, cats can eat small amounts of rice. It's safe, so a little bit in their food won't hurt them, but you shouldn't give them too much because it's not an important part of their diet. Number 44. Why do cats have this pattern? The tabby pattern is caused by differences in the agouti gene, which controls how the colors in the fur are spread. Different stripe patterns are caused by the different ways this gene can be changed. Number 45. Are they all the same? No, tabbies have different designs, like classic, mackerel, spotted, and ticked. Each design has a different way of putting stripes, spots, or swirls together. Number 46. What colors can a tabby be? Tabbies can be dark, gray, black, orange, and even silver, among other colors. Most of the time, cats with darker coats show the design best. Number 47. Are tabbies a certain kind of cat? No, tabby is not a type of cat. It is a pattern of fur that can be found on many breeds, such as domestic shorthairs, Maine Coons, Bengals, and Scottish Folds. Number 48. Does every tabby have a M on its forehead? No, not all tabby cats have the M mark on their foreheads. But it is something that many of them have. It is thought to be a mark made by wildcats in the past. Number 49. Do tabbies have certain traits that define them? No matter what their hair looks like, cats can have different personalities. Tabbies, on the other hand, are often described as friendly, playful, and loving pets. Number 50. Are tabbies more likely to get sick than other cats? Tabbies, like all cats, can have health problems, but there is no proof to show that they are more likely to get certain conditions just because they have a tabby pattern. Number 51. Can tabbies have eyes that are not the same color? Yes, tabby cats can have different colored eyes, such as green, yellow, brown, or even blue. The color of a cat's eyes is controlled by its genes and can change no matter what its coat looks like. Number 52. Can a male tabby cat also be a calico cat? Even if a cat has tabby markings, it is very rare for a male cat to be a calico. Because the genes that control the color and design of the coat are on the X chromosome. Most calico cats are female. Number 53. Do tabby cats get along well with kids? Children can have a lot of fun with tabby cats as pets. 
but it's important to introduce cats and kids the right way and watch how they connect to make sure it's safe and fun for both. Number 54. How do I take care of my tabby cat? How a cat needs to be groomed depends on how long its fur is. Short-haired tabbies usually need less care, and they might only need to be brushed regularly to keep them from shedding. Tabbies with long hair might need to be brushed more often to keep their fur from sticking. Number 55. How much do tabbies shed? Like many other cats, tabby cats may shed at certain times of the year or all year long. Your tabby's coat will stay healthy and shed less if you brush it often. Number 56. Can tabbies learn to do things? Yes, tabby cats are smart and can be taught with the help of positive reinforcement. With the right training and time, they can learn tricks, use litter boxes, and even walk on a leash. Number 57. Are tabbies good hunters? Like most cats, tabby cats have a natural desire to hunt. They are good hunters because they are quick, agile, and quiet. But each cat can be different in whether or not it shows these hunting habits. Number 58. Can tabbies live with other animals? Tabby cats usually get along well with other pets, like dogs and other cats, as long as they are introduced to them the right way and are socialized slowly. It's important to watch how they talk to each other at first to make sure they get along well. Number 59. How do I keep my tabby cat from getting sick? To keep your tabby cat healthy, feed it a balanced diet, take it to the vet for regular checkups and shots, and give it preventative care like flea and tick control. Also, make sure they have clean water, a litter box, and a safe place to live. Number 60. Can tabby cats be signed up to go to cat shows? Some cat clubs and groups let tabby cats into cat shows. But it depends on the rules and standards for the breed. If you want to register a tabby cat for a show, you may have to meet different rules for each breed. Tabby cats make wonderful pets because of their unique coat patterns and sweet personalities. By giving answers to the 60 most asked questions about tabby cats, we have learned more about these interesting animals. Tabbies continue to bring joy and company to many homes around the world, whether you're interested in their patterns, habits, or care. What are your thoughts about our video? Feel free to leave your comments below. You can also share your amazing moments with your cat that can help our community to love their cats more and more. If you like our video, kindly give us a thumbs up and do subscribe. Also don't forget to hit the notification bell for more amazing cat videos. Thank you for watching. Please check our other videos for more amazing facts about cats. Spread the love and until next time.